Hello YouTube viewers, Waki here. Now I play Elder Scrolls Online very, very casually and with a great deal of mediocrity, all right? I'm not the best uh, player. I enjoy the questing. I enjoy just socializing and what have you and running the odd dungeon, you know, doing a delve or two, yeah. buying decent gear. And the gear in the game really makes a difference. The problem is grinding is no fun for anybody. So it was quite a relief when I found the Tamriel uh, Crown Exchange. It's sort of like a brokerage guild. Um, a lot of people will advertise in chat that, you know, they want to buy this particular item off the store. Can you gift it to them? Problem is, we're talking about real world money here, and there's a lot of scammers out there. So the Tamriel um, Crown Exchange is something I was invited to, and I've had re really good success. And if you try and scam them, they just ban you outright. They seem to have a pretty good relationship with uh, Zenimax in that uh, they list the people that are scammers in their uh, Discord. And if you try and scam somebody, you're going to get banned. So this is a really safe and secure and uh, legitimate way of converting your stipend every month of 1500 uh, or 1650, I think it is now, crowns a month into gold in the game. So if you're a casual player like me and you haven't got a lot of time, you can take that uh, those crowns and buy game uh, gold and save yourself a lot of time in the grinding and, you know, overall just improves the enjoyment of the game. And it's safe and secure. That's the nice thing about it. So I've put the link on the screen above the... Uh, video over here i'm going to put it under the, uh, in the description as well it's the tamriel uh, crown exchange and the way it works is as follows they got a discord server you join it um you put in your screen that your in-game name i just warn you guys again do not try and scam anybody because you will get banned permanently it, it's not they, they keep logs they record everything and they will report you to zenimax so only if you're a legitimate person and you have no intention of scamming someone do you join these uh, this particular brokerage guild um if I sell something, I have a 5% tax on any gold that I gain. So basically, if you're a seller of crowns, you'll get 190 in-game gold for every single crown. So um, this transaction over here, um, the buyer would pay 200 gold per crown. So that would be 500,000 gold. That would be 700,000 gold. It sounds like a lot, but anything that can be gifted, you can basically buy with in-game gold and this includes the DLCs obviously you can't buy the chapters the uh, like the Somerset chapter you can't buy that you've got to buy that with uh, real currency but if you're a type of guy who's got a lot of time to grind and can make a lot of gold and it actually is quite easy if you've got time to make gold in this game if you're a crafter etc you, you can make some good money I mean crafting roots sell for like 60,000 uh, gold a pop so you can make money in this game if you've got time I unfortunately do not so it's quite a relief like I said to be able to convert my crowns Pay money for time rather than time for, you know, uh, spend the time doing it. It's kind of like the uh, Warcraft token system. And it's a really good way of actually, and a safe way of, of, you know, doing the conversion. So anything you want here, 200 gold per crown. That's 800,000. Um, we sold a lot of these. These are currently on special. Uh, when I say we, I'm not affiliated. I'm only a member of this particular brokerage. I'm not getting anything for doing this. I'm not sure if they will actually end up giving me something for promoting them. I don't even know if it will be successful. But like this over here, I mean, I've made like 266,000 gold for every single one of those that I've sold. And I've sold three. As you can see, I'm sitting here with uh, um, 840,000 gold. And it really, it makes the game more fun because I can buy my gear I want pretty quickly. I'm not aiming for to be a top tier player. But it makes the game easier, especially if you're a new player. You take your your uh, crowns, you convert it into gold, and you can buy some training gear early in the game without having to worry about uh, you know getting the professions up and what have you. So there you go. That's the uh, Tamriel Crown Exchange, um, and the way it works is as follows: completely organized. They got these brokers on the Discord. You join the Discord, all the rules and regulations are there, and you can. Ch uh, hopefully, they don't get a an overwhelming influx of players from this because I know I've got quite a couple of subscribers but uh, they don't many I think only about 100 or 200 people actually watch the channel still my own fault I don't do enough videos but anyway so all the instructions are there but the gist of it is as follows buyer decides what they want they go to the store for example if it's a thousand crowns like maybe a, a speed mount upgrade or something like that so they say okay I want to spend a thousand crowns I want to buy this they say, okay, well, the price is 200,000 gold for that. Um, one of the brokers then posts it on the the forums itself, the, the Discord forums. One of the buyer, uh, sellers of crowns, accepts that they'll, they'll do it. First come, first serve, whoever sees the offer go through, clicks it and, and selects it. Then what they do is they say, okay, cool. They whisper you, they meet in game, they meet the buyer, they meet the seller, and they meet the broker. The buyer gives the gold to the broker, and he says, okay, 
dude, I got the money, it's all good. You can go buy the thing and gift it to this particular person. You buy the item with your crowns, you gift it to the, uh, to the buyer. The uh, broker sees the receipt, everyone confirms the receipt, and everything's recorded, logs, video recorded, etc. And then the broker gives you the gold when everyone's happy. And that's it. It's an easy way of convert and a safe way of converting your crowns into gold, or if you've got a lot of in-game gold, buying um, things. And it's at a reasonable rate. 190 gold per crown is a very fair rate, and 200 and a 5% tax is is nothing really. So. Buyers pay 200 gold per crown, sellers get 190 gold per crown. So there, if you found this useful, there is a link above this, uh, my head over here, where you can see um, the Discord server, you can join them. I, I was gonna put, uh, actually show you a transaction going down, but I don't wanna, you know, have people hassled, or, you know, I don't want people to contact the broker directly and, you know, cause chaos. Rather go to the Discord server that's mentioned, read about it. I can confirm this is 100% legit. Um, if it wasn't, pretty much everyone's going to get banned. So, I mean, I've done it. it it's not a scam. I mean, Blizzard doesn't doesn't have an issue with it with their tokens, and these guys don't do it have an issue either. Otherwise, they wouldn't have gifting options. So, anything over here basically that can be gifted, you can gift furniture and a lot of people go for the cheap stuff, and it, it's it's nice because it, it, it's easy, like things like this. You know, that's like hundred thousand gold right there. I mean, that's actually not a lot of in-game currency if you think about it. I mean. I, even with my limited playtime of about an hour, two hours a, uh, a day maybe, I haven't had a problem really. But uh, it's just handy having more gold so you can buy a decent set of gear to quest with. It just makes the entire game and the entire experience more pleasurable, especially leveling up crafting and stuff. So there you go. The description is going to be for the Discord server. It's going to be in the description below the video and above the screen over there. Hope you found this useful. This is Wocky signing off. Oh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. The more... Uh, I see the more in I'll be uh, enticed to maybe make more videos. Um, I am moving overseas shortly, so I'm going to probably have a little bit of a dull zone until about uh, February 2019, um, but I I'm going to have spotted internet access after that. There you go. Thanks for watching. Till next time, this is Waki signing off, and uh, thanks for supporting my channel.